Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm PR box for the month of May 2022. And I'm so excited. I've seen a few variations already and I'm just like stoked. I can't wait. So let's just dive right in. Also, if you guys are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It helps me a ton. Oh, we've got a little something extra in here. Some of their refreshments. So refreshments started with Ipsy and now they're also available for purchase in the BoxyCharm site as well so if you guys are interested definitely check them out i actually have not tried them before so it makes everything so much easier so that way you're able to just get everything monthly and not have to worry about going out on your own to get supplies for shaving or different essentials i actually have purchased from their refreshments line a candle and oh i love the candle it smells so good and it looks so cute so this is the box that they sent me and this is the refreshments dazzling five blade razor kit this is the coral crush one wow this is like a heavy handle and it's got a little bit of like silicone-y texture on the bottom and then this one is kind of like metal so it seems like actually a nice quality razor it doesn't feel super cheap and it also does come with two cartridges and it has five blades on each one and then it does come with a little thing to stick on the wall to attach your razor to and it is magnetic so that's really nice makes it a lot easier guys so you don't have to worry about like putting it on somewhere and then this can actually hang and dry correctly instead of sitting there and it can get rusty and everything so i actually really like this kind of innovative i think it is a great idea and i'm actually impressed with this i didn't think it would be as nice of a quality as it is so that's a nice thing all right into our boxy charm box we have got we're gonna start off with what would have been the choice item and this is the siate london dewy blush retails for 22 dollars. and this dewy blush is a next gen gel balm tint blush that is set to shake up and refresh your beauty routine gone are the days of chalky powder blush I like chalky powder blush because I have oily skin. With an ultra lightweight finish, dewy blush leaves just a subtle hint of color that you apply to your cheek, blending effortlessly to a modern glass-like sheen. Formulated with natural extracts of yuzu and dragon fruit, this blush brightens your base, leaving your skin with an even and healthy flush of color. It is a tiny little tube. After seeing it in the pictures, I was like, it is definitely gonna come a lot smaller. This is what it looks like put on and blended out just a tiny bit. Let me blend a little bit more okay so you get a nice little sheen of color it smells good I would say though it it feels a little bit sticky to me like sticky oily which for somebody with dry skin I would highly recommend this for but me with oily skin I don't know if I really like that it definitely gives you a glow though I don't know I'm on the fence with this nice product but I think it's more for dry skin we have a product from pharmacy I love pharmacy's products this is the honeymoon glow body 12% AHA BHA resurfacing body serum I have been wanting to try this since last year when it was in one of the boxes and I kept telling myself no I don't don't need it in the drop shop and pop up and everything else that was going on so I never ended up purchasing it and I've been dying to try it just because I think it's a really cool concept and you should be exfoliating your body and everything as well every once in a while a body hydrating and resurfacing serum that instantly softens rough skin and eliminates bumps with AHAs and BHAs leaving skin remarkably smooth with a lit from within glow and it retails for $40. If you're gonna be using this, make sure you wear your sunscreen. I've heard different things about the scent of this, so I'm gonna smell it. I like their other honey products, so I wonder if it smells like honey or something else. We're gonna have to scratch that. I'm gonna do a try on video with these in a little bit in a few days maybe even on sunday we'll see or coming next week i cannot get this open right now so we're just gonna have to hold off on that next product we've got is by a company called v cosmetic this is their creamy liquid velvet lipstick unlike any other lip color you've ever seen this liquid velvet lipstick is the product you need to add to your makeup kit formulated to be creamy lightweight and long wearing make a unique statement with your fashion forward vibe retails for 22 dollars and it is a new brand to boxycharm i have never heard of this brand before and it is a liquid lipstick if you guys don't know me i'm just not very big on liquid lipsticks so i'm not sure if i'm gonna like open this one or not i may just keep it for like a giveaway or something i'd rather give it to somebody who's going to be able to use it a little bit more than me it is a really pretty color though it is like a deeper mauvey 
pink, but a little bit more pinker. Next product we've got is the Skin Ink Supplement Bar Serum Glow Filter Hydra Micro Capsule One Fluid Ounce. Wow, this retails for $50. Glow up with the world's first skincare makeup, Serum Glow Filter. Blending beauty and technology in one bottle, this clever concoction is formulated with rare gold hibiscus extract and Skin Inc.'s top two best-selling serums, niacinamide and hyaluronic acid, to give you a selfie filter in real life. It's perfect for day use and is personalized to your skin tone using light reflective technology that enables external light to bounce off your skin, creating a glowy pearlized finish and reduced appearance of pores and red skin tone. I need this in my life. This is a strange top so it just goes over the front of it and then you pull it out and this actually guys this blush is making me itch a little I think. I think I might be having a reaction to it. Got a little bit of this out on my hand. Texture feels nice. It definitely feels really hydrating. Has a tiny bit of a scent but I can't really explain what it smells like. It's not sticky tacky. It definitely just feels like hydrating and almost like a water cream on your skin as a serum or like a water serum, I guess. <laughs> it definitely feels very, very light. It is absorbing pretty quickly and it just feels really nice. So I'm excited and I'm hoping that this will help with my redness because I get red very easily. Today's video shout out word is refresh. If you comment refresh down below in the comments first, you'll get a shout out in my next video. Moving on to, oh, sadly our last product. This is by Basic Beauty and this is their eyeshadow primer. It retails for $18 and this is an eyelid primer base formulated with hemp seed oil to moisturize and maximize color intensity for a crease free look that lasts for up to 12 hours. I could use a new eyeshadow primer, so this is nice. All right, so I am going to do a try on video with you guys uh, in the next few days, hopefully. You guys will see that soon, but just for my unboxing, I am impressed with this box in some ways, other ways, kind of, I don't know. I am excited about the Skin Ink Serum. I'm excited about the Pharmacy Body Serum. The eyeshadow primer... I could use one. Cool with that. The Ciate London blush, I think I'm having like a reaction. I don't, it's very sticky on my skin and it feels kind of drying. I, I don't, I don't really like the texture of it. And then the liquid velvet lipstick looks super, super pretty, but I just, I don't really wear liquid lipsticks too, too much. And then we also have our refreshments bundle, which is really nice actually what did you guys think of my box let me know down below and if you guys got your boxes yet let me know what you guys got in your boxes i can't wait for my paid box to ship because i know it's going to be different the total retail value of this box is 152 dollars so a great value for the box and that value is excluding the razor set so let me know what you guys thought and i will see you guys in my next video today's video shout out goes out to Jenna Rotella. Thank you so much for watching my videos. If you guys want a shout out in my videos, make sure to watch the entire video and look out for the shout out word. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button and turn your post notification bell on so you guys are updated every time I post a new video. Love you guys. Bye.